Okay, you join me here on day two of the Sell for Gold Regatta here down in Weymouth and Portland, and I'm joined by the uh, Team GBR uh, Olympic manager, Stephen Park. How's it going? Well, so far, so good. Uh, you know, second day, quite different conditions today from yesterday. Uh, yesterday was sort of light and moderate winds, the wind direction has changed, and we've now got um, a fairly fresh wind, not too windy, but it's certainly wet out there. Everyone's coming in, looks like they've been swimming ashore rather than being in their boats. Um, but performance-wise has been going fairly well, fairly steady performances. Um, we had about seven on the, on the sort of podium positions at the end of last night, but of course it's only day one of the regatta, so you know, not getting too excited after one or two races. A few more performances today, things have gone fairly well. Um, probably our only issue at the moment is we, we've had a black flag disqualification for being over the start line at the start in the, in the second last race of the day with the 49er, Stevie Morrison and Ben Rhodes. So they're just looking at that and seeing whether we think there's an opportunity for redress there. Um, but other than that, so far so good. We're quite pleased with, with progress. And what are the uh, weather conditions looking like for the, uh, the rest of the week? So we've had no wind and now we've had quite a bit of wind. Getting worse or better? Well, I think it's going to get a bit wetter and a bit windier before it gets better, and then probably just a bit windier. Um, and uh, by certainly by Saturday, uh, yeah, probably we won't see many people walking their dogs along Chesil Beach um, for fear of them being blown off their leads. Um, but uh, it will hopefully dry up a little bit, which will be quite nice. So as long as it's windy but not too windy and not too wet, then everyone should be quite happy. Uh, and then... Unfortunately, I don't think we're going to see a lot of sun this week, which is the only thing that we've missed out on. Otherwise, we'd have seen a full range of Weymouth conditions, uh, which, of course, is of course what our visitors are keen to see in the run-up to the Olympic Games. Is this a, a good opportunity, sort of, in these final few days leading up to the games, to sort of have a look at the guys in the team and see how they're going, or can you never tell? Yeah, I mean, the, you know, the, all the sailors are all now selected for the team. They're keen to make sure that they they deliver that performance of at least being the top British boat, which is never easy in a team that is as competitive as ours. Uh, they've done the majority of the hard yards. The period after this regatta is about putting the final touches on their performance. And so they really are looking to put, put on good good show here um, and just to make sure the routines that they're running through are working for them. So it's about us uh, from a a support team perspective, supporting the athletes and working with them to make sure that the routine that they've got through the day, the routine that the team has got is going to be optimal for their performance come games time. And this is really the final opportunity we've got to trial that. Next time we'll be doing it for real.